What is up guys, Rim Rider back again with another epic adventure. Today guys, we are in this random abandoned house. This looks to us like one of those warm up houses, you know, kind of get the juices flowing, getting things ready for a good day of airbags. But anyways guys, let's check it out. Alright guys, so we're starting this explore off on the upper level of this abandoned house. And as I mentioned, just a random discovery driving along to other places. And it turns out it's actually a pretty cool spot. And you can see the wall is coming down. There's major decay, but we got a little Christmas ornament there. Major decay in this place. You know, I'm gonna look at the ceiling there. It's all coming down and I noticed on the floor that is frigged. Like it's lots and lots of water damage and over time. Now I'm not sure how long this place has been abandoned, but I would say judging by the state of it, it's been a while. I mean, major water damage in here. In the bathroom, obviously. And then you got a what is up, guys. Oh, look at this wall. This wall's completely gone. But you can see the original boarding. Which tells you this is a really old farmhouse. And look at this beauty tub. It looked like a cloth, but it's not. But it's the same style. It's probably the master bedroom. Gotta love it when the vines grow up the side of the house and over the windows. Small little bath or a closet, sorry. And right there, that's where a stovepipe would have originally come up, or they would have just had that open to allow the heat to come upstairs in the days before four stair uh, furnaces. And like, look at this landing super decayed, lots of peelies, and this linoleum or whatever kind of floor it is is frigged all the way along. But look at this wall. Awesome colors and textures. But then huge piece of like Egyptian art here. It's actually a pretty cool piece. It's huge. It would have been difficult to get it up, put it up there anyways. What's back here? Oh God. So this is like a desk? Talk about a creepy place to have a little home office kind of thing. filing cabinet I mean, I'm not gonna check it all but look at the pile of debris outside it's concrete bits so people have been dumping on the property which was a dead giveaway to us oh got a boys bedroom looks like the whole Marvel gang here a little Ewok R2D2 and C3PO and again another one of those uh, floor vent things. Big Star Wars fan. Is that Boba Fett? I don't remember his name, but... And you got the whole squad right here. And of course... What is up, guys? Big mirror. Kind of cool, actually. Setting was a peeking in. Oh, another kid's bedroom. You, me, and the sea. Got some jellyfish. Oh, you got some sharks up top there, and I forget what that thing is. What is it a dolphin? Not a dolphin. It's like a. Anyhow, I'm sure someone will tell me what it is. Another big mirror. You got Finding Nemo and all the gang. I don't know all their names, but they're all here. And look, another dead giveaway. Couch sitting out there on the front lawn. Not a normal thing to have on your property. 
And all these kids' toys left behind. Well, they got anything interesting in here? A little castle, got some DVDs. Oh, South Park. The Stick of Truth. But interesting place so far. So that's it for the upstairs. Let's go check out the main floor now. Nice wide staircase though. So I guess that's easy to get that gigantic art up this up the stairs with such a wide staircase. I'm just gonna put my camera down for a second. Good to go. And so here is the main floor. And again, very noticeable water damage, but you saw what upstairs was like. Oh, and there's the, uh, that would have been into that boy's bedroom where the, uh, the stove pipe went up, so they did close it off. Oh, look at how disgusting this light bulb is. It's a weird looking bulb, too. But yeah, we got vines growing here. This would be your front door. Have a little peek outside. We'll show you the outside. Don't you worry. Then we got the kitchen. Some really funky yellow color there. But everything is just coated with this like greasiness. They must have been smokers inside the house because it's pretty nasty looking. Like even the tops of those lights, I don't know if you guys can see that, but there's like a brown coating. Oh wow, and look at the frame around the window. And this would have been where the uh, wood stove sat and obviously they had it vented out for a chimney but originally the vents probably went all through the house to provide the heat again another window just covered in vines both of them actually this one's been busted out it's this pantry yeah we got a couple beers still here unopened i'm not going to drink a bando beer guys It kind of looks like it wasn't well taken care of just because it's kind of frayed looking and like it looks like they try to wash the wall and just gave up on it because it's like clean all around most of it but then you've got that one filthy area what's this what's oh, the basement don't typically don't go down in the basement but it looks like there's stuff right here so i mean may as well have a look Got some MGD sitting right there. Man, there's like a six pack worth of beers in here. Oh, the basement's pretty frigged. Looks like there was a bedroom over there and that's just full of garbage. So I'm not even gonna bother with that because it's like just piles of garbage. But that's okay. Here you got your back like mud room. Definitely dog people. And you can see the back is just super overgrown. And like I said, people have been dumping garbage here like crazy. So guys, we're now outside of this house, just checking out the property and stuff. Looks like there might've been a fire pit here. That's pretty cool. That's a nice little pit. But over here, we've got a playground. Super overgrown. And looks like we got a trampoline back there. Also, wicked frigged. Everything's super overgrown out here. And you can see the roof. I don't know if it's too bright or what, but there's definitely signs of a bad roof right there, which is why you've got all that water damage upstairs. Well, let's go have a little look in the barn. I don't often go in barns, but there are sometimes there's treasures in there. And like, look at that boat. It's super overgrown. Now, I can tell you this for sure, is that this property is owned by a developer, as many of these are. Nice little shop here. 
There's actually quite a bit of stuff still left behind. It's an old gas tank. Got a little horsey toy right there. Giddy up. Just lots of random crap in here. That would have been a nice shop for some guy. Oh, got a camera tripod. Of some sort, or some kind of tripod. Oh, that'd be for a telescope. And like, look at this. There's a weed growing out of a box randomly. Let's see if I can get to that barn somehow. Without getting covered in burrs. Oh, another little storage area. Triceratops there. You got some old comics and weird shit stuff. Actually, a lot of interesting things in this little spot here. But I want to get to the barn because if these things have a lot of stuff, then the barn probably does as well. Like, how the hell do you get over to it? Well, I guess I can get over this way. Oh, jeez. Look at the weeds underneath the table. It won't pop in through the middle, that's cool. It's kind of looking like the barn's empty, but we'll still have a peek. Yep, she's empty and sketchy looking too. All caving in right there, the whole foundation. Yeah, I'm not going to risk climbing in there. I don't think it's worth it. A little desk, though. There were the animal stalls down there. All right, guys, well, that's the end of this epic adventure. Random abandoned house. Great little warm-up house to start the day off. But anyways, guys, tell me what you think in the comments down below. If you're not subscribed, definitely subscribe. Smash the like button. And remember, guys, always come back because Rhythm Rider always has that epic shit. All right, thanks for watching. Peace. What is up, guys? Rhythm Rider back again with another epic adventure. Today, guys, we are in this abandoned house. This is a warm-up house, kind of like when it needs place. Uh, all right, guys, well, that's the end of this epic adventure. Random abandoned house, wicked for a kind of, uh.